Hello viewers, welcome back to our channel ICCC. We are a Bangalore based register company. We have branches in Hyderabad and West Bengal. I am your education counselor and my name is Jayant. So before moving ahead to the topic, let me tell you what we are. We do guidance to the students from I3C that is Information Come Career Counseling Center. We alert application dates, counseling application dates and we inform about procedure for counseling. We guide the students to fill their application form. We explain about seat matrix. We let them know the latest cutoff scores of the particular colleges. We suggest the best colleges for your career pathway. Fee structure are explained accordingly to their particular concern. We help through document verification. We guide admissions for the management seats and also for the NRA seats as well. So in this video, let us see about JSS Academy of Higher Education and Research Center. JSS was established in the year 1981 and started in the year 1984-85 and is imparting education in medical science MBBS courses. It is recognized by the MCI Medical Council of India and was affiliated to the Raju Gandhi University of Health and Science, Karnataka, Bangalore from the year 1995-96. It has now become a constituent college of JSS AHER established under Section 3 of UGC Act from 2008, May 28. The college has a sprawling of 43-acre campus surrounded by a lush green garden in Sri Shivaratreshwara Nagar, Mysuru. In JSS Hospital, they have 1,800 beds under one roof is one of the India's biggest hospital and also have one of the biggest critical and emergency care facilities with 260 beds. Let us talk about college fee structure. For general merit, the tuition fees is 13 lakh for fee thousand. There is no increase of amount from the last year comparing to other few deemed universities. They have increased up to 10% comparing to JSS it is as it is the same and there is other fees where you should also pay 1,25,000 including that your total fees for the first year will be 14,75,000 and the other subsequent year you will be paying 13,50,000. For NRI candidates the tuition fees is 32 lakh <laughs> and there is other fees where you should also pay 1,25,000 so your total fees for the first year is 33,25,000 and for the uh, KEA students that is Karnataka Examination Authority for those students the fee structure is approx uh, 1 lakh uh, comparing to other deemed university this this college has a lowest fee structure so the total intake of MBBS seats is 200 out of 200 12 seats are reserved for the KEA counseling which is Karnataka examination authorities those seats are allotted only for the Karnataka residents and the 30 seats are allotted for the NRI candidates and the rest 158 seats are reserved for the management quota so now I'm going to explain you about KEA counseling the Karnataka counseling is conducting in three rounds round one the fresh registration done during first round candidates must take precaution about categories and clauses as per the kea information bulletin most of the students do mistake during application filling so please read information bulletin while filling the application form after filling the application form document verification is done as per the uploaded document we have done during registration process there's a note Till need 2019, it was an offline verification, but as per the present situation, COVID-19, it is expected to have online verification of document which is uploaded. As it is uh, online verification, you must have all the latest documents included, caste category, religious minority, EWS, other docu documents must be ready with the student. After verification choice filling, process will be started. And after the first round of choice filling, mock allotment is allotted. And again, choice filling option will be open. Once you have selected the college of your choice and done with it, that will be remain. Till second round, as there is no provisional for fresh entry, only resuffling is done 
second round note after the announcement of the result if you got your choice of allotment there are four option with students choice one i am satisfied with allotted seats and i am willing to uh, report to the allotted college choice two i am satisfied with allotted seats but wish to participate in next round choice three i am not satisfied with the allotted seats but wishing to participate in the next round choice four i am not satisfied with kea allotted seats and i've got seats somewhere else i'm quitting round two in need 2019 no fresh entry was allowed but we are expecting fresh registration in 2020 no mock allotment is allowed note the students who have got allotted seat only left over with higher options and lose their rest of option so our advice from i3c will be please put your choice wisely in the first round once if the seat is allotted there is no exit system available either you have to report the allotted seats or you should quit the counseling mop up round in 2019 it was often mop up round in 2020 we are expecting online mop up round as it is done for online pg stray vacancy round in the final college round list of 10 times of the registered candidates number of stray vacancies will be sent to the private colleges which is to be exhausted strictly in order of merit and now i'm going to explain you about mcc counseling process mcc counseling is centralized counseling where the allotment is done on the merit list as per the category of need ug mcc counseling is done for 15 percentage of all india quota two rounds of counseling is done for government seats and three rounds for 100 percent deemed uh, delhi university central university all fours medical college around one students have to register as per the category for an example religion minority muslim jain subcasts are uh, obc sc st and so on after registration there will be an exercise of application filling and locking of choice followed seat allotment and result publication all the student allotted seats for mbbs bds seats must report the college for confirmation of seat which allotment letter downloaded from mcc website students must carry downloaded mcc allotment letter with original document and fees as mentioned in the website for college reporting there is a note mcc gives four choice after allotment of seats choice one is the candidate has to confirm that he or she is satisfied with the allot allotted seat choice two i am satisfied with the allotted seat to wish to participate in second round in this condition candidates must report to the allotted colleges and pay their prescribed fees and and apply for application in second round choice two i am not satisfied with allotted seats but wish to participate in second round by getting the allotted seats choice four is i am not satisfied with mcc allotment seats i have got the seat somewhere else so i'm quitting round two for participating in round two the candidate registered in the first round no need to register again but fresh registration is allowed after registration the students have to exercise their choice as per the seat available they will be locking off the choice process of seat allotment and result publication all the students have got the seat must report to the college there is no free exit option available mop up round in mop up round registration is allowed by paying a deposit note all the seats of all india quota 15 percentage left over or lab seats after round two will be reversed back to the concerned state government mop up is conducted for available seats of deemed university central university delhi university is done by online counseling by exercising available seat choice locking process of seat allotment publishers result stray vacancy round after this mop up round there will be a final college which will be done either online or offline because of covid 19 situation with the list of 10 times of the registered candidates when you want to know about our service and packages this is the basic package of rupees 5000 we provide application notification updates sms alert for all the states stepwise application filling 
guidance for Karnataka, NRI general fees updates, round one to mop up round, and SMS hour. These all the services will be provided for the basic packages. So when you look around our premium package, which will cost you around twenty thousand, you have a beneficial of uh, state wise application filling guidance for. a uh, few states that are karnataka panicheri punjab uttarakhand rajasthan west bengal tamil nadu telangana andhra pradesh and so on and also you have a best possible option by our expertise available throughout india and overseas so this is one of our best package as you know uh, so coming to our professional package which will cost you around 50000 we will be providing each and every guidance and services through us and uh, beneficiary of this pack is uh, you'll be guidance from nri document for mcc and state council as well uh, so from our side this will be the best package from ictc thank you for watching this video for more inquiries contact to my number and my email id which has been displayed on this page for further details and more videos please subscribe to our channel and if you like this video give us a thumbs up and let us know anything in this comments box below